Yo, what is good, Sammy Squad? Back at again with another video here today, man. We've been doing a lot of fan appreciations, a lot of training varieties, but we forgot about the OG King Pack, the Pro Fantasy Pack. So we're gonna drop 1 million coins into that today. The fan appreciations have been garbage for me. Training varieties haven't been that great for me. I know a lot of people are making coins, having good pulls. Mine haven't been that good. So I'm gonna go to the Pro with the market being up. The Pro Fantasy might be better than those packs. So that's why I want to give it a test today. But before we do get into the 1 milli coin Pro Fantasy pack open, you guys know what I have to say. Say it in every video. Make sure you guys hit the like button right now. Hit the sub button if you haven't, man, because a lot of y'all watch the videos and haven't hit the sub button. I mean, what the heck are you doing, bro? Hit the sub button. Also, put on post notifications, man. Join the Nodi gang. Let it the comment section and let me know down below what pack have you guys been liking more between the fan appreciation, the training variety, or the pro fantasy pack. So, I already put a card on the trade block, I think. So, let's just mark where we have to stop. It'll be 3 3 2 1 0 0 0. All right, so we're going to stop there. That'd be a million coins into the pros. I don't know, dude. I feel like pros, the market is up right now. So as long as you're getting like three elites in the pro fantasy and, you know, some high golds, it's not a bad L. Okay, we're not going to be getting that many elites in this one. We got some high golds and one elite. Make it two elites. 87 Raheem Mostert. Okay. And you guys know at the end of the video, I will add up all the elite cards and kind of get an estimate about what we're getting back. But yeah, fan appreciations have been garbage. I was hoping that they were greatness. I hoping that they were good, but... They haven't been for me, so I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I wish they were a lot better. I wish EA would do something because something about that pack is not very fan appreciating. But all right, 89 Marshawn Lattimore. I think 89s are anywhere from like 5 to 10K, just depending on which one you're getting. Let's keep on moving, keep on going. I think 87 Ultimate Legends are like 3K right now. So we need to see some big pulls. We need to get some big coin pulls come on some plats that'd be real nice 83 83 81 okay we'll take that keep going so far nothing at all from the pros we've gotten just a few little elites our highest pull is an 89 come on come on let's see golden ticket rings redux plat there's so much good stuff we could get and we haven't messed with these we've given them some time to charge up Turkey, 86, 80, 81. We'll take the 86. This might be our first, like, somewhat decent pack just because we got an 88, 81, and an 86, but that's not that good. Come on, silver. No elites there. Uh, we'll just take the silvers just so I can exchange them. Ooh, vet. 91. We'll take it. Not bad. I really am curious to see if the pro fantasies can even live up to anything after, you know, we have supposedly two of the best packs in the game. One of them was kind of more of a disappointment than the other. I think you guys know which one I'm talking about. Cough, cough, fan appreciation. Not good. Gold card. Elites, we gotta see ya, come on. 79 Vet, 90 Cordell, 90 Cameron Bray. We'll take Cordell Patterson. He did get a golden ticket, but it was the cornerback and you can't power those up. So that card doesn't make a difference at all. But guys, we're 200K down. 200K down the drain, we have a 91 and a 90 to show for. That is not, that's not what we're trying to do right now. Um, we'll take the golds. Had to do this for, ooh, 89. Had to do this for some King of the Packs. Marcus Spears, 89. Marcus Spears, 80. That Marcus Spears likes me. But, yeah, I wanted to do this for King of the Packs as well because we needed to test out and see just kind of, like, how this pack is looking. Because the market's up. It should be better. But it's not looking better. Just pull-wise, it's not looking better. I don't know, value-wise. Oh, I could have got a high gold. Shoot. 82, 80, 82. Okay. I feel like the second round of the pro, we should honestly just be at, it's a guaranteed elite card. Like it should just be a guaranteed like 80 plus for every slot. Cause we're kind of just at that point in the game where it, that should not be a gold card. Take those. 83, ooh, big flash. Come on, don't be an 87. 90, all right, we'll take it, something. 
about 250,000 coins down the drain. 240, but 240, highest pulls in 91. We got some 90s, we got some 89s. Don't think we're doing horrible, but we're not doing good. This is where we would love, love to see a GT, another vet. 90, we've gotten three veteran 90 pluses already. Take that. Okay, we'll take all elites, four elites. What do we got in the second? 90, okay, I like that. 90 overall, Devin Bush. So an all elite pack right there. We are actually officially at the 300K marker. Like I said, I think we're probably at 175K. Think we need to get like a 96, 97 to kind of get us back into where we need to be. You, elite. Elite, gold, big flash. Ooh, 93 junior. So our 93s, those gotta be like 25, 30K. So it's a good pull, but guys, we gotta see something good here. We got golden tickets in packs. We got brand new ultimate legends in packs. I mean, there's so much stuff we could get and we need to start seeing it. 80, oh, I don't know why I thought that was an 83, guys. I thought that was an 83 and I was about to say, that's a really good pull in the first, but we'll take that. Whoa, okay, 96 overall team of the week. Let's go. Ooh, oh my gosh. See, that's what we needed. Mike Hughes right there. Okay, 96 overall team of the week. That's a glitch pull right there. Don't know how much 96s are. I'm assuming this has got to be like, what, 70, 80K? I kind of want to look right now. Spoil it, 80. That's not bad, 80 and a plat? Okay, we'll tell you, that's almost 100K pack right there. That's like a probably cl closing in on 90, 100K after tax. So we'll take it. Great pack. Love to see it. Oh my gosh. Okay. Now we're getting started. Now let's just stay on pace. Give us stuff consistently. I'm not asking for 99s in every pack. I just want some consistent bangers. We've got less than 600K now. We're looking for a GT. We're looking for Ultimate Legend Rings. We're looking for a Redux. We're looking for Plats. I mean, the list is endless. We're looking for draft players. I mean, it's literally endless with this pack. That's why I like it so much. And flashback, bam. 95 Joshua Gordon right there. Okay, that's what we like to see. These are the pulls that I wanted to see. Okay, 96 and a 95 now. We're not even halfway done with the opening. Dude, honestly, I feel like this is better than fan appreciations if we're being 100, 100%. So if we're being 100% honest, these are probably better. <laughs> Literally. Yeah. 81. Take all those. Come on. Come on. Big flashy legend. I was going to say, we need a legend banger. 88, I'd read. Okay. Yeah, Legends, we got a 93 Legend, so we've gotten something, but let's see something a little more. Or Ultimate Legends. We haven't got Ultimate Legends at all. Haven't really gotten many good promo cards, I would say, like 93, 94 plus promo. Let's see. Uh, and that doesn't really make sense because we got a Josh Gordon. Oh, Redux, come on, come on. 93, okay. I actually just sold this Rodney Hudson today, too, and I sold him, I think it was for 33K, so... It's nothing crazy, but it's a redux that's not a troll. So we can look at it as a W and keep moving. I think if we could keep it up, man, we're doing okay. Two golds, two elites, heavy weight, bam. 89 Ndamukong Sue paint. I don't know if this Ndamukong Sue goes for anything anymore. I'm gonna take the 91. I might regret that. I know when I know when his 99 was cheap, it it like went up a lot. But I think now that the 99's gone up, I don't think that goes for as much. We'll just take that 91 and be happy. All right. Whole lot of golds, yeah. Whole lot of golds. Take those. Super Bowl 88. Dion heavyweight 91. Okay, we'll take that. Deion Sanders power up usually goes for something, but 
we're obviously going to take the 91. So back-to-back 91s. The second half is off to a good start. I like it. I would like to see like an 84-plus plat, a 95-plus player, and then just consistent 90s, and I'd be happy. Come on. Come on, EA. Show us something nice. Show us something heat here. All golds. We need a good elite. 93 Legereus Sneed. Let's go. Okay, we'll take that. 93 right there. 93s are like 30. Not a bad pull. We'll take it. Keep moving. This is literally better pulls than I get from the fan appreciation pack. And the fan appreciation, we should be getting a lot of good stuff from it. But we just don't. For whatever reason, we don't. All right, we'll take three golds and an elite. 91, little animation, big legend right there. And our first ring of the video, it's an 88. Okay. Not Honestly, not a bad start to the uh, second half. I think we have three 91s and a 93, so. Peyton Turner. Oh, okay. Not bad. 88, 86, high gold, and low gold. Not a bad first. What about the second? Flashback. Bam. 89 Ryan Tano. We'll take it. It's not an 87. Not bad in 8. Well, I don't know what just happened with that pack. I don't know. Maybe they didn't give us all our cards. But we got an 88 and an 89 in that. So that might be coins back. Come on. Come on. Come on. 250K, guys. Oh, I'm getting worried. I'm just like in the, my head doing the math and we're not there. We're not anywhere near there. Okay, wait, hold up. Whoa, that's a, oh my gosh. That was an almost elite first round. I've never in my life seen that. An all elite first round. Holy crap. That's nuts. I say this has potential to be the juice pack. No, that's still a good pack though. I've never in my life seen an all elite first round, but... It's an all elite pack right there. Okay. Take all of those. Redux, come on, man, come on, come on. 97 Bradley Chubb, I just said it. Let's go. Big banger Redux right there. Bradley Chubb in the building. That's one of our best Redux pulls that we've got. We've actually tied my highest out of like a normal pack. 97 overall Bradley Chubb Redux, yes. That's what I'm talking about, bro. That's the type of stuff we needed to see. Let's go. Great pack. I'm going to save that and we'll add that up when I get to it. But holy crap, bro. That is what we needed to see second half. Now let's keep it up. Pro fantasies are back, bro. Pro fantasies are back. I honestly like these better than fan appreciations for coins and value. Let's see. Ahita. He, 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 yeah. That's not a heater, but second round cheese, maybe? Big flashy legend. What'd it do? 90 out of read. Okay. Wrong. Redux. Oh my gosh. Redux. <clears throat> okay. It's okay. We got a 97, so I'm not going to sit around here and complain about an 88. We're just going to ignore it and take Ed Reed. That was a lot of trolls in one pack. The wrong Ed Reed and the wrong Redux, but we're just going to keep moving. don't know if we got a 98 or not i'm not sure really bad first round oh another redux what 91 dude i always get this tristan works dude that's like our fourth redux of the opening holy crap redux is dude that's i miss reduxes that's why i like pulling these we can at least get reduxes man i don't know why they didn't put them in the training variety that had just made it too juiced honestly might get back like 850 if i were to guess i would say 850 rising star 89 jalen we'll take it 89 jalen waddle guys we have 68k left to go that would give us about four packs four to five no, probably five packs we'll do five come on power up Javon Kinlaw, a lot of elites. Okay, take those. 
89 we'll take it honestly i'm fine with that pack elites in an 89 will get us our coins back probably I'm, I'm curious to see what we got here and then what we're gonna um when we add everything up what we're getting back uh, we'll take all those last pack anything 93 team of the week ronde barber to end us off that's a great way to end us off team of the weeks good job Reduxes, good job. There's a lot of um, animations that did a good job. Let's go to the item binder and see what we got going on. All right, so elites, we got 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75 80 so we had a we had 180 elites holy crap that was a lot it's the most elites i've ever gotten in a milli so i'm gonna add all this up going off usually i'm gonna check and see what prices are and i'll let you guys know what i do afterwards but let's see if we got our milli back All right, guys, great news, immaculate news, the news Samius likes to hear. So how I did my math is 80, 84 is I put in for 2K after tax, which is might be a little bit more than what they go for, but if I do sets with them, I'll for sure get that. 85, 86 is I put in for 3K, 87, 88 is I put in for 4K, and anything 89 plus I would look up on the auction block. So after tax on all my 180 elites, Great news, 1,036,000 coins, so not even including gold cards, not even including silvers, not even including these power-ups like these. I didn't even add these in. I mean, they don't go for too much, but gold cards, silvers, power-ups, easily another 75K. So we ended up making over 100K coins, and I lowball myself on a lot of my cards. Like Bradley Chubb, I put him in for 130K. Now look at what he's been selling for. I didn't know if this was like true 200, 190, 178 shows 150. So I've just been like, okay, I will just put in for 130. If he sells for 150, that's kind of after tax. But I lowball myself on a lot of my cards just to make sure like I'm getting like, you know, a number that like makes sense for you guys. Cause I don't want to be lying about anything. I do this at every single card up by those prices that I said earlier. So yeah. 100k profit not bad that's probably my best coin pack opening that i've had all week so pro fantasies man that's kind of nice we did get some really good pulls but i don't know man this could be an interesting king of the packs i think i got a lot of hot takes for king of the packs people are going to be upset people are going to be mad but there's some things i gotta say so thank you pro fantasies for letting me have a good opening you just love to see it great samios opening make sure you guys hit the like button hit the sub button put it on post notifications drop it down below what would you rather pull between the fan appreciation training variety or pro fantasy kind of want to know what you guys are thinking about that but i'll see you guys in the next video or stream man it has been real 100k profit real peace